plan with me in the neutral horizontal Erin Condren, and I am using a kit from Sponsored by Coffee. I do have a coupon code for Connie's shop, and I will go ahead and put that on the screen now. Um, I've mentioned before, Connie has my absolute favorite personal sized kits. She also has my favorite horizontal kits. Um, these kits are no white space. You can cover like every single area almost of the horizontal planner using these kits. And I love them. Um, I, however, had said that I wanted to use this planner as more of a all pen planner. Um, but I do have a ton of Connie's horizontal kits. So I decided that I was going to try one out this week and see kind of how it works for me, if I like it as much as doing all pen. Um, so far, I'm loving it. Today is Wednesday. I did film this on Sunday, though, but I'm just now getting around to doing the voiceover. Um, but I am loving it. I really like having the structure of having an actual, like, ombre heart checklist. Granted, a regular heart checklist would be fine as well, or, I mean, it's a horizontal. You could even draw little circles and check those off. But I do like having my day divided into sections, so I end up having a heart checklist, um, and then just a pretty full box, and then over to the right, my half boxes and my little things. Um, but yeah, so I decided to try something just a little bit different this week, and so far I am loving it. Like I said, today is Wednesday, so we are right in the middle of the Wednesday sale. What I decided to do was put all of our functional items, um, like our January monthly colored sets, those kind of things, April, there's a Bianca set, um, they are all on sale for $1.50 for today, probably until like noon tomorrow. Um, so all sheets are $1.50, including glossy, um, because I'm trying to get rid of as much stock as possible before I move. So um, that is today, and then Friday will be the start of our 40% off moving sale, which is a huge coupon. We don't normally do anything quite that big unless it is like Black Friday. Um, but like I said, I don't want to transport stickers. It scares me. I think that they're going to get ruined, which is really a possibility, especially when I'm moving furniture and everything else. Um, so we're going to try to get rid of as much stock as possible. So this Friday will be the start of a 40% off sale. That will end on Sunday. And then next week as well, we will do it one more time. Um, and I don't think anything is going to be restocked before then or during then. I'm really just trying to get rid of what I have right now. Um, anything that doesn't sell, we will probably box up and move to the new house, but I'm not 100% sure yet. I'm not totally positive what I want to do, and I haven't even started packing, so I've not even, like, kind of assessed the situation as far as how much is being moved. Um, I mean, I know it's a lot, like, I know it's a lot, but it's not in boxes yet, so it hasn't really clicked. Um, also on Friday will be the end of our 25k giveaway over on Instagram. So we are giving away four mini happy planners as well as some happy planner accessories and $20 shop credit to each winner. Um, so if you haven't entered that and you'd like to, that is over on our Instagram page. And to enter, all you have to do is follow the shop and tag a friend in the comments. Um, so that's going to be going on on Friday. The winners will be announced. And then on Saturday, we will be shipping those. Um, also, as far as orders placed during the sale, we're going to try to get those shipped out as soon as possible. I'm really hoping to take the weekend and package all of them and have them ready to go on Monday. Um, what else? I feel like that's kind of it as far as shop-related things, maybe. Um, I am going to be doing some D-Stash giveaways over in the Facebook group, which is linked down below if you're interested. Um, every like three to four months, I'll go through all of my stickers and anything that I know that I'm not going to use that I think somebody else could use. Um, I kind of throw them on a pile and do a little giveaway in the Facebook group. Uh, but as far as this week goes, I have mainly been going through and just getting rid of everything that I can. Um, I did the closets and the dressers yesterday. I think we ended up with six or seven huge trash bags just full of clothes that we ended up taking to Goodwill. Um, I still need to go through and do shoes, and then I'm also selling off my, well, let me, I don't know how many I have actually, but quite a few of my A5 Kiki Ks, it's just not something that I use anymore, so I'd rather go ahead and get rid of them instead of taking them to the new house. Um, I've also been thinking about it, and I, I said this in the Facebook group, but I think I'm going to be getting rid of my GM Louie. Um, I just, I really don't use it very often, and I know that those are so hard to find, so I think there's somebody who would really love to have it and would actually use it, and I just have not been using it very much lately. Um, ever since I got this horizontal planner, as well as the mini happy planner, I just haven't really been reaching for it. I think I'm going to keep my MM, even though I really am not using that one as much either, but I do carry that one in my purse with me, so it gets a little bit more use than the GM. 
Um, anything else shop related? I am working on mini happy planner kits. I'm not 100% sure what I want to do with those yet. I've got two separate ideas as to what I would like to do, um, but they're both very, very different, so I'm not sure which one I'm going to go with yet. I also have been working a little bit on the monthly kits. A ton of people ask about those. I personally hardly ever use a monthly kit or even my monthly view in my Erin Condren because I always use um, either my GM or my MM Louie, the inserts from So Much Crafting, and I kind of keep track of everything through there. Um, so I'm not 100% sure what to put in a monthly kit because it's just really not something I use. Um, so I'm not, I'm just not 100% sure what everybody wants to see in one. Um, but I will probably end up doing a poll in the Facebook group about that just to see if anybody has any suggestions or if there's anything um, that's just super important for a monthly kit to somebody that really likes using one. Um, what else? I, I feel like that's kind of it as far as shop things go. I still haven't decided whether or not we're going to shut down while I move. It's kind of going to depend on after I get everything to the house and I start unpacking. It's going to depend on how long I think unpacking is going to take me. Um, I was going somewhere with that and I just, I just totally blanked. Oh, YouTube videos. Okay, so I'm going to be filming this Sunday. I will be filming all of my plan with me's. Um, and then I believe, sorry if you can hear my planner rustling, but I'm looking at the date. The next Sunday, I think that I'll still be filming, but after that, there's going to be probably a decently long gap of time that I will not be uploading while I'm trying to get everything unpacked and, well, packed first and then unpacked and then moved and everything else, so. Um, but I will keep everybody kind of updated on that. I'm going to try to pre-film as much as possible so that I do have some videos to put up. Um, and then also, once I do move, um, I will be doing an office tour. That's something that I meant to do before I left here. Then I was realizing that I would be moving soon. So I will wait and do that and give you guys the, uh, the tour in the new house, which will probably be two bedrooms worth of office. So... Um, I'll definitely do that once I move, but that is the end of this plan with me. You guys can see this beautiful no white space spread in the Erin Condren horizontal. If you like this, go check out Connie's shop, and I will text you guys next time. Bye, guys.